Hello everyone, Hiromi here, and I got yourself a high damage game on Avera Razan. Last time I mentioned that this ship will get 150 or possibly 200k if there's a lot of battleships. Well, your boy got 150 on this and usually it ends up with a lost. <laughs> Let me know you have games where you have high damage gameplay but ends with a lost. We all been there before at some point. Anyways, Avera is quite an easy ship to play with a lot of skill ceiling, which I have a feeling Red has 200k damage battles on this, which you can tell there is so much potential on her. By the way, sub to Red Gaming Dino, he is a DD main like no other and a flank master, so I expect seeing him on the flank in most battles. After a couple of games, is Alvaro broken? Well, yes and no. Alvaro can delete destroyers the fastest besides Columbo or HE for months, but when against Molens or actual DD Hummers, Chances are survival dwindles, so you do have to watch out which you will see on this gameplay. Enough chit chat, let's go to the gameplay. And there's Stalingrad. Alright, perfect. So my side is Stalingrad. And there comes the torpedoes. I believe those are Shimas, which is obvious. Okay, so they're on the other side with the other destroyer there. Okay, so yep. Yeah, Alright, so it's gonna get some torpedoes on that Stalingrad, which is perfect Hopefully that will deal some damage and if I'm lucky, which I'm not, flood Like I said, I am not lucky <laughs> Okay, alright, so repub is next. Uh, I could probably go behind this rock while I'm gonna see and focus on that and Our team just the action guns like usual Alright, heal myself, and then... Now I know that Repub's gonna slow down if I fire, so I'm just gonna go let it go, and then now stop firing. Engine boost activated. We hit the Two enemy. fires, and a flood, damage comp, which is usual. Problem. That Repub is gonna focus on our booster, right? Nice so, shot! Yep, he's gonna focus on the booster. And fire from that last salvo. Miss. Torpedoes on that Repub. AP loaded just to get the flat finisher. Stern. Repub out. All right, three destroyers still alive. Damn. All right, I need to start pushing in then. If those destroyers are still alive, I really need to go in there. All right, so there Enemy is the area. Black Montana. Just used that. I'm worried about the small lance still. I I think the small lance is over there, but we're gonna go ahead and start capping this. All right. Yep. There's our that. Ah, we start pushing. Start capping, start pushing. We need to start making some changes here. There's a Shimas. Target hit. We hit the enemy. No. Our team captured. Damn, they really going in a team formation. Looks like they actually got some either either they got lucky with the coordination or not, but still that is bothersome. Still 
little bit Shima no. I still have my Good job. I can just go ahead and go for Torpedoes. I'm screwed already. Hundred fifty K. I'll take the hundred fifty K. All right. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, I should have engaged right in the center on that one. If I would have engaged on the center, I would actually took down those three Shimas. But that small one still. Oh my god. I was not expect the small one to come out like that. Oh, that's scary. Oh. Hundred fifty K. I'll take the hundred fifty K. I'm fine with it. Second place. Let me guess. Small ones. No, Shima. Shima, okay. Shima got probably our Colombo and probably got our St. Vincent. Yeah, okay. That makes more sense, but oh my god. <laughs> 153k, okay. That is probably the world record as of right now. I know I'm using my press account, but this right here is probably the record as of now. And then maybe I'll probably break more records after that because I feel like Red is going to get 200k's on this one. Because he is a DD main. I am just a cruiser gunboat main right here. And seeing how Veil works is... <laughs> oh wow. Okay, so I took down the Repub. I took down two Shimas before the game's over. And then I just had to burst fire Smolens because I know I will die. But the good part is... I retain my KDA, my KDR rate. Alright, that's enough for me today. I apologize for a lack of commentary gameplay, but I'll make it up right here. Overall, Alvera is the best DD hunter you got there. Better than Rigolo, Kavros, and potential contenders, um, Gadons and Kulbear. She does the work very well, and if you use the burst fires right, you can take down destroyers with ease and hopefully not leave them 1%, like that one Shima player. I still got a lot of training to do, but regardless, expect this ship to be in the cray because it is a tier 10 after all, and the chances is around 1% or probably less. If you want to be like Avero, we go right there, but it doesn't have the smoke to stay in there, but my closest option is Gadance. Although no AP, the HE is already good enough, and everything on her is the best tech tree destroyer hunter in my books. Anyways, please do like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll be looking forward to seeing you at seas next time, until then. Jeanne.